recording right now is the have you ever been hypnotized before no no okay so have you ever i'm sorry (laughs) yeah yeah go ahead go ahead Uh, have you seen people get hypnotized before yeah i don't believe it (laughs) (laughs) but are you willing to try it at least or like give it a chance yes okay okay well this should be fun especially if you don't think hypnosis is real okay (laughs) so did you saw the youtube channel yes i've seen all of the google (laughs) stuff okay okay so um first things first is you know just like you said you don't believe in it um hypnosis only work if you want it to work okay you have to be willing to be hypnotized okay i I can't like force you to be hypnotized and you know it's just not gonna work um second thing is uh, make sure there's no distraction coming your way so no music in the background or other people talking um other thing is oh you already said you're not high right you're completely sober you're not drunk or anything okay perfect um last thing is i mean do you have any questions before we start like you know like do you even you know i'm gonna try to show you how hypnosis work um, especially if you you know pretty skeptical of it then you know are you, do you have any questions how long how long is it gonna take um it really it really depends um because you know like if like you, you can go whenever you know i don't want to feel like you have you're obligated to stay here you know um and obviously if it's not working just let me know because i don't want to waste your time okay all right so um, uh, mm-hmm. i'm sorry can i go close my door quick yeah yeah, yeah. take your time take your all time right. do you have a do you have a chair if not it's okay yes is it is it possible for you to sit in a chair yeah okay okay thank you because I just want to make sure you don't like uh, fall down and stuff just to be safe okay I mean when when you when you saw people get hypnotized before like was it in real life or you saw it in videos or no I just saw videos on oh, videos okay so that's why I, I think that's the thing is especially through online session normally I hypnotize people in real life but obviously with all the quarantine going on right now it's really hard so um, you know I don't know I'm, I'm not sure if you, like you said, you don't believe in it, but, you know, just, you, you said you're willing to try, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. So, go ahead and just put your, put your hands on your lap, okay? Perfect. And last thing is, is it okay if you close your eyes? <laughs> okay. So, go ahead and just keep your eyes closed and just take a nice deep breath and then just try to clear your mind, okay? Like I said, hypnosis only works if you want it to work, so it's completely up to you. Go ahead and just take another nice deep breath in, but this time just hold it. And just keep holding it now. In a moment, I'm going to count from three down to one. And when I reach the number one, just let your shoulders completely relax in three, two, one. Just exhale now and just feel your shoulders completely relax. Now, try to focus on my voice and try to focus on how amazing it is to feel your shoulders completely relax. Take another nice deep breath in. But this time, just exhale whenever you feel like it. Just feel yourself becoming completely relaxed now. Just try to allow my voice to guide you. And just try to allow yourself to become completely aware of this wonderful state of relaxation. Now, if you really want to try hypnosis, make sure you follow this next suggestion. No matter what happens, no matter what I say, no matter what you do, just keep your eyes completely closed. No matter what happens, keep your eyes completely close now take another nice deep breath in and like i said just exhale whenever you feel like it and just allow yourself to relax even further now now even though your eyes are completely closed put your right hand on top of your head put your right hand on top of your head perfect and take another nice deep breath in and just like i said just keep your eyes completely closed now now even though your eyes are closed look at your right hand on top of your head your eyeballs looking up at your right hand your eyeballs staring up looking up are your right hand on top of your head and what you'll find is the more your eyes look up the more your eyeballs look up stare up at your right hand on top of your head the more your eyes are going to be completely stuck shut the more you try to open your eyes the more they're completely stuck shut now try to open your eyes and they're completely stuck shut now stop trying and just take a nice deep breath in and just like i said just exhale and just now just feel your eyes completely relaxed 
Now in a moment, I'm gonna come from three down to one, and when I reach the number one, just let your right hand drop by your side, and just try to become more focused and become more relaxed than you are right now. Take a nice deep breath in, and three, two, one, just let your right hand drop by your side, and just like I said, just try to focus on my voice now. And like you said, you've seen hypnosis work before, you've seen hypnosis work before, so what I'm gonna do is something called an instant induction. And what that means is you're just going to enter a really relaxed state really, really fast. In a moment, I'm going to say the word sleep. But as soon as I say the word sleep, you're not going to fall asleep. You're not going to pass out. All I'm doing when I say the word sleep is allowing yourself to go even more relaxed, even deeper than you are right now. And as soon as I say the word sleep, as soon as I say the word sleep, just let your head fall down through your chest. And as soon as your head fall down through your chest... Just feel yourself becoming even more relaxed. Just feel this instant wave of relaxation as soon as you let, you let your head fall down through your chest. Nod your head if you understand. Perfect. So go ahead and just take another nice, really deep breath in. And this time, just hold it again. And just keep holding it. And as soon as I reach the number one, as soon as I reach the number one, just feel your body completely relax. Feel your body melt, sink all the way down to the chair. In three, two, one, exhale now. And just feel yourself becoming ten times more relaxed. 10 times deeper than you are right now. And take another nice deep breath. And then this time, just exhale whenever you feel like it. And just like I said, just allow yourself to go even further, even deeper. Because the more you focus on my voice, the more you're completely aware of how amazing it feels. How amazing this relaxation feels. And again, take another nice deep breath in. And just exhale whenever you feel like it. But this time, just try to focus on your lungs. Now, feel and focus on your lungs expanding now. Just become completely aware how relaxing it is to feel your lungs expand every time you take a deep breath. Take another nice deep breath in. And just become completely aware of your lungs now. And the more your lungs expand, the more you relax. And the more you relax, the more your lungs expand even further and further and further now. You can just find your neck becoming so relaxed. Your neck is becoming so relaxed now. I can barely support your head as you go even further, even deeper, and deeper, and deeper still. And like I said, as soon as I say the word sleep, just let your head fall down to your chest. So you instantly go twice as deep as you are right now. As soon as I say the word sleep, you can just feel this instant wave of relaxation from the top of your head going all the way down to the tip of your toes. Now... Instead of taking deep breaths, instead of taking deep breaths, breathe in and breathe out really fast. Just like when you're hyperventilate, breathe in and breathe out even faster and faster and faster and slow down and just take a nice deep breath in and just feel how amazing, how relaxing it completely feels. To even feel like, because even right now you're still aware, your lungs are expanding, even right now you're still aware how amazing it feels as you go even further, even deeper. Now again, Breathe in and breathe out even faster. Breathe in and breathe out even faster and faster and faster and sleep. Just let your head fall down to your chest as you instantly go twice as deep. I'm going to count from five down to one. And when I reach the number one, you're going to be 500. 500 times more relaxed from five. Completely focused. Four, completely relaxed. And three, completely letting go in. Two, so close to the final number. Take another nice, really deep breath in. And one, just feel your mind drop, melt, sink all the way down to your chest as you completely relax, completely drift away. You can just feel your body melting, sinking, dropping all the way down to your chair as you go even further, even deeper than you are right now. And the deeper you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. Now in a moment, in a moment, I'm going to snap my fingers. And as soon as I snap my fingers, just imagine... A hundred helium balloons tied in your right hand. As soon as I snap my fingers, just imagine a hundred helium balloons tied in your right hand. And what you'll find is as soon as you feel a hundred helium balloons tied in your right hand, you can just feel your right hand being pulled up and up in the air. You can just feel every single helium balloon make your right hand go up and up in the air. And the more your right hand goes up, the more you relax and the more you relax, the more your right hand goes up in the air as soon as I snap my fingers. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper, 
And the Bristol in the deep break, got a battery, fill in the battery, feel the deep break, you can put it to go. And like I said, as soon as I snap my fingers, just feel a hundred helium balloons start in your right hand. And as soon as I snap my fingers, just feel your right hand going up and up in the air. And the more it goes up, the more you relax. And the more you relax, the more you go even further than you are right now. Take another nice deep breath in. And three, two, one. Just feel a hundred helium balloons on your right hand now. And like I said, the more your right hand goes up, the more you relax, and the more you relax, the more your right hand goes even higher. Because in a moment, I'm gonna snap my fingers again, but this time I'm gonna put 200 more healing balloons in your right hand. And as soon as I put it, your right hand go up even higher. And the higher it goes, the more you relax, and the more you relax, the more you go even further than you are right now. And what you'll find is every single healing balloon not only pulls up in your right hand, it also pulls up on your mind. Your mind feels floaty as every single healing balloon make it completely go up in the air in 3, 2, 1. 200 more healing balloons so you completely relax even further. Your mind feels so relaxed, so light as it feels floaty as it goes all the way up in the air. Now your mind feels so amazing as you go even deeper. And this time I'm gonna snap my fingers again. And however, this time I'm going to put 500 more healing balloons and take a nice deep breath in. And 3, 2, 1. Just feel your mind completely relax with 500 more healing balloons. As you go even deeper, even further than you are right now. Now in a moment, I'm going to snap my fingers again. But this time, I'm going to cut all the strings as soon as I snap my fingers. And as soon as I cut the strings, as soon as I cut the strings, your right hand's gonna instantly drop all the way down. And at the same time, all the healing balloons is gonna completely go all the way up. As soon as I snap my fingers, and at the same time, your mind is gonna drop a million times more relaxed, a million times deeper than it is right now. Just like your right hand dropping instantly all the way down. And at the same time, your mind's gonna completely let go just like every single healing balloon as it goes all the way up in the air. As soon as I snap my fingers, take another nice deep breath in. And three, two, one. Cut the strings as so you become a million times deeper, a million times more relaxed, and completely letting go as you go even further, even deeper than you are right now. Now in a moment, in a moment, I'm gonna ask you to open your eyes. But as soon as I say the word sleep, as soon as I say the word sleep, you instantly go twice as deep as you are right now and you instantly let your head fall down to your chest. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper and deeper and deeper still. So like I said in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But as soon as I say the word sleep, as soon as I say the word sleep, you instantly go twice as deep and you instantly let your head fall down to your chest. And what you'll find is that every time I say the word sleep, what you'll find is everything I say becomes your reality. Everything I say becomes the absolute truth. Just like whenever you're dreaming, you're not really completely aware of what's happening, but the more you follow along, the deeper you go and the deeper you go, the more it completely feels even more relaxing, more amazing than it is right now. Nod your head if you understand. So you go even deeper. And the deeper you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. So like I said, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. And as soon as you open your eyes, you can just feel refreshed. Feeling so amazing, so energized. But as soon as I say the word sleep, you instantly go twice as deep as you are right now. As you instantly let your head fall down to your chest. Nod your head if you understand. So you go even further. Now, one, two, three, open your eyes, feeling refreshed and relaxed. Okay, so I hope that wasn't, you know, do you feel relaxed right now? Yeah. Okay, perfect. So, like I said, I'm going to say the word sleep. And as soon as you say it, just let your head fall down to your chest, okay? And just allow yourself to go even further. Just take a nice deep breath in. And three, two, one, sleep as you go even deeper and deeper and deeper now and the deeper you go the better you feel and the better you feel the deeper you completely go and like i said every time i say the word sleep every time i say the word sleep just let yourself go even further even deeper than you are right now and what you'll find is every time i say the word sleep everything i say becomes your reality everything i say becomes the absolute truth nod your head if you understand as you go even further even deeper and deeper 
and deeper still. Now in a moment, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is you cannot remember your own name. The more you try to remember your name, the more it just completely fades away. The more you try to remember your name, the more it's just completely gone. Just imagine your name being tied to a healing balloon. And the more you try to catch the healing balloon, the more it just floats up and up in the sky. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper and deeper and deeper still. So like I said in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is you cannot remember your own name. The more you try to remember your name, the more it just completely, completely fades away. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper and deeper now. Now, one, two, three, open your eyes, feeling refreshing and amazing and energized. Okay, I completely forgot to introduce myself. My name is Patrick, but what was your name, by the way? Mm. Hmm, that's your name? Hmm, I've never heard of a hmm as a name before. I mean, it's easy to spell for sure, but did you hear what I said? Like, can you hear me right now? Yeah. <laughs> okay, just just try to relax, okay, because I don't want to freak you out, okay? Just try to relax. So, like I said, my name is Patrick. And, you know, obviously this is, you know, this is a YouTube video and I'm just trying to introduce ourselves. My name is Patrick. And what was your name, by the way? <laughs> oh so, God. yeah, so this is this is the problem. OK, when you watch somebody being hypnotized, obviously in videos, it's really hard to know if it's fake or not. Like, obviously, I don't know if, you know, maybe you're faking this thing or are, are you really trying to, you know, remember your name? No, I'm really trying to remember <laughs> Okay, okay. So have have you ever forgotten your name before? Have you ever forgotten your name? No. Before? No. Okay, okay. So we're gonna do a test. Okay, we're gonna do the test. As soon as you touch your forehead, only when you touch your forehead, you'll remember your name. But as soon as we stop touching your forehead, your name is gonna be completely gone. So go ahead and just touch your forehead and like I said, we'll just do a test, okay? Now what's your name? Mali. What is it? Mali. Mali? Mali. Can you can you type that real quick? Oh yeah, yeah. Make sure you keep touching your forehead. That's pretty smart. <laughs> um, I I feel like oh Melanie. Okay, okay. Now stop touching your forehead. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's gone. Okay. So what's your name? Okay. Now touch your forehead again. Melanie. <laughs> So, okay, this is this is going to be interesting, okay? Because I've never done this before. I've never asked somebody to type their name in chat. But can you read your name right now in chat? Can you see it? But as soon as you stop reading it, it's going to be completely gone. Now, what's your name? <laughs> you just read your name, right? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, okay. So obviously go go ahead and touch your <laughs> go ahead and touch your oh forehead God, again. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean are are you okay? I don't wanna freak you out. No, are you, no, are you I'm fine, I'm fine. You're fine. Okay. Cool. I wanna make sure because Okay, so touch your forehead again and then tell me your name. No. Okay, so what we can do, you know, especially if you're trying to introduce yourself, just touch your forehead and then you'll be okay. Or or do you want it back? I want it back. You want it back? Okay, okay. So just so like I said, in a moment I'm gonna say the word sleep and just let your head fall down to your chest, okay? And just allow yourself to relax. Obviously I'm gonna bring you your, your name back because that would be pretty embarrassing if you don't know your own name. I think that would get a little crazy. So just take a nice deep breath in. And three, two, one, sleep as you go even deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper. Now the deeper you go, the better you feel and the better you feel the deeper you completely go. Now in a moment, in a moment, what you'll find is your name is completely back. Your name is completely back. And you'll remember forgetting your name. You'll remember forgetting your name. Nod your head if you understand. So like I said, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. And as soon as you open your eyes, you just feel refreshed, energized, and amazing. And you'll remember forgetting your name and your name is completely back. The name your parents gave you is completely back forever and ever. Nod your head if you understand. However, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But as soon as you say your name, as soon as you say your name out loud, as soon as you say your name out loud, what you'll find is you're going to 
instantly go twice as deep and you just instantly let your head fall down to your chest. Just like whenever I say the word sleep. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper. So like I said, as soon as you say your own name, you instantly go twice as deep and instantly let your head fall down to your chest. And you'll remember what happens every single time. Nod your head if you understand. Okay, perfect. Now, one, two, three, open your eyes, feeling refreshed and energized. Okay, so do you remember forgetting your name? Yes. Okay, and you told me in the beginning, right? You felt, you know, you don't believe it. You don't. <laughs> so you don't believe in hypnosis, right? But I mean, no, like, I didn't. <laughs> well, thank, thank you so much for trying it, especially, you know, if somebody doesn't want to believe in hypnosis. And, you know, if they just say, oh, yeah, it's not going to work, then obviously it's not going to work. But you have to be willing. You have to be, you know, willing no. to give it a try for it to work, okay? Because if you, like, let's say, because there's a lot of YouTube videos out there, like, oh, yeah, this video is going to hypnotize you. But if you have oh, an expectation, <laughs> yeah, so, like, you have to give it a try. Okay, so just to test it out. So wh what's your name? Melanie. Okay, so what's happening? Okay, say it again. Melanie. So you go even deeper and deeper. And like I said, as soon as you say your name, you go even, it becomes easier for you to go twice as deep. As soon as you say your name, you go even deeper. You just instantly let your head fall down to your chest and you instantly go twice as deep as you are right now. And you'll remember what happens every time you do it. Nod your head if you understand. One, two, three, open your eyes. Okay, feeling refreshed. Okay, w w do you know what just happened right now? I just, you, remember, I just remembered my name. Yeah, but, um, you know, as soon as you said your name, something happened. Do you remember that? I was... I was <laughs> <laughs> okay, say it again. Do it again. Do it again. Because I just... Okay, say it. What's your name? Melody. So you go even deeper and deeper. And every time you do it, it becomes even easier. It becomes even faster. So you go drop twice as deep as you are right now. And like I said, you'll remember this happening every time you do it. Nod your head if you understand. One, two, three, open your eyes. Okay, so <laughs> let's make sure because you don't want to say your name and next thing you know, you're trying to introduce yourself to someone and then you say your name and you kind of just like fall asleep in front of them. I, th I don't think that's a good idea. Okay, let, let, just try really hard to stay awake, okay? Try really hard to stay awake, okay? So again, my name is Patrick and you know, obviously this is a YouTube community and so what was your name? Melanie. One, two, three, open your eyes. <laughs> you did it again. <laughs> okay, okay. This time, try really hard. Try really hard, okay? Okay, I so, <laughs> so, like I said, my name is Patrick. And what was your name? Valerie. As you go even deeper and deeper and deeper. Now, the deeper you go, the better you feel. The better you feel, the deeper you completely go. Now, every time you say your name, every time you say your name, it won't put you back to a sleep trigger every time you say your name it's just completely back to normal you don't go twice as deep and your head does not fall down to your chest every time you say your name it's just completely back to normal nod your head if you understand as you go even deeper and deeper and deeper now now in a moment in a moment i'm gonna ask you to open your eyes but what you'll find is you cannot remember the number between three and five every time you count every time you count it's one two three five six seven eight nine ten eleven and whenever you count down it's ten nine eight seven six five three two one and what you'll find is it just feels normal feels natural to skip that number between three and five because there is no number between three and five nod your head if you understand as you go even further even deeper and the deeper you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. So like I said, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. And as soon as you count, it's 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And when you count down, it's 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 3, 2, 1. And like I said, there's you. it feels normal. It feels natural to skip that number between 3 and 5 because there is no number between 3 and 5. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper, even further than you are right now. In a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. And at the same time, what you'll find is as soon as I say the word hypnosis, as soon as I say the word hypnosis, you just instantly burst out laughing. Just like whenever you watch a really funny 
YouTube video, you just instantly burst out laughing as soon as I say the word hypnosis. And every time I say it, the funnier it gets and the funnier it gets, the more you just completely lose it as soon as I say hypnosis. Nod your head if you understand. And the more you try to figure out why you're laughing, the funnier it gets. The funnier it gets, the more amazing it completely feels. And every time I say it, you just completely lose it as soon as I say hypnosis. So like I said, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. And But what you'll, what you'll find is you cannot remember the number between 3 and 5. And as soon as I say hypnosis, you just instantly burst out laughing. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper. And deeper now. One, two, three. Open your eyes, feeling refreshed and energized. Okay, so I want to do it again. So, like I said, my name is Patrick, and what was your name? No. Okay, so <laughs> I just want to make sure you remember it, because, like I said, you know, you, you don't want to embarrass yourself, or you know. But anyway, anyway. So, what do you think of hypnosis? <laughs> yeah. What, what What do you think of hypnosis? <laughs> So you know, I mean, I love hypnosis, but you you said you think you don't believe in hypnosis, right? Are, are you are, are you okay? Are you okay? Yeah. What's going on? Why are you laughing? Why why on earth are you laughing? Okay, we're gonna do a test. Okay, we're gonna do a test. Can you put both of your hands in front of you? Okay, both of your hands, and just look at your hand, look at your palm. Put both of your hands in front of you, both of them, and. Can you tell me how many fingers do you have in both hands without counting? Like, in total. Like, how many people does people normally have? Fingers. How many fingers does people normally have? I mean. Eleven. Okay. Okay. So, can you count starting from one all the way to eleven? Just to make sure. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, eleven. Okay. Perfect. So... Next, now this time, count each hand, okay? And move every single finger when you count. Just count one hand at a time and just tell me how many fingers you have, okay? Starting from one hand. One, two, mm -hmm. three, four, oh, three, four. Count again, count again, yeah. Count starting from one. One, two, three, five, six. Okay, now count your other hand and see how many fingers you have. One, two, three, five, six. Six plus six is what? Oh. So you said you have 11 fingers, but you counted 12. Okay. <laughs> Count again. Count again. Okay. And six plus six is. <laughs> okay, so what, what's what's one plus one? What's one plus one? Two. Two. Okay. What's the what's two plus two? Six. Two plus two is six. Oh, I think it's three plus three. Oh no no no! Two plus two. I'm sorry. Four. Okay. Perfect. So. Like you said, you know, you asked me in the beginning, you know, like, how long is this going to take? I want to make sure I don't take up enough uh, because we're, we're almost talking for like 30 minutes, okay? But before I end it, or, you know, we can keep going. It's completely up to you. But do you have any, like, I can use hypnosis as a tool to, like, maybe help you with motivation? Like, do you have uh, trouble with sleep, sleeping or, like, maybe focusing in school or, like, maybe cleaning your room? Is there anything? I'm sorry. Yes. Wait, wait. I can't hear you. I'm so sorry. Can you say that again? Yes, yeah, that's that's completely fine. You know, like like this is this is completely normal. I mean, obviously I'm going to bring the number 4 back, okay? <laughs> Cuz I don't want you to mess up your number, especially if you're, you know, doing some important counting once you're really rich, you know. You want to make sure you know your numbers. But like I said, is there anything you want hypnosis as a tool to help you with? <laughs> so you want help with sleeping? Yeah. Okay. I mean, my sleeping schedule is really messed up too because, um, you know, like I think everybody just stays awake right now because you know it's it's it's, it's pretty bad. Um, I mean, are you in the uh, are you in the lockdown right now? I mean, the coronavirus, wherever yeah. you're at. Okay. So you know, I mean, like I guess you've been at your house for quite some time then. I'm assuming. Okay. So this is something that I do. Um. 
is there any place that you would love to visit? Like, if you can tomorrow. Like, if there's, like, if, I mean, like a tourist spot. Like, you know, do you want to go to Paris or, like, Hawaii? Or... I want to go to Venice. To where? To where? Can Venice, you type it? Italy. Oh, Venice, Italy. Okay. So you want to go to, like, the, the boat and stuff? Mm-hmm. Have you ever been there? Okay, I heard it's really beautiful over there, and I would love to be at the boat. Like, you would love to actually be in the boat and, you know, just, you know, go through the river? Yeah. Okay, okay. So, go ahead and just, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try, okay? Um, you know, like, what's gonna happen is, you know, this is the power of your mind, okay? I'm gonna try to explain it as we go, but just try to relax right now. And, okay? And just take a nice deep breath in. And three, two, one, sleep as we go even deeper and deeper. And deeper and the deeper you go, the better you feel, and the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. Now, in a moment, I'm gonna count from five down to one, and when I reach the number one, you're gonna be a million times, a million times more relaxed than you are right now. Take a really nice deep breath in, and five, just feel yourself going even deeper, and take another nice deep breath in, and just exhale whenever you feel like it, and four, even further, even deeper than you are right now, and Three, two, and one. Just completely dropping, melting, sinking even further and further and further. Now, the deeper you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. Now, the number four is completely back. The number four is completely back. Every time you count, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And whenever you count down, it's ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even further, even deeper than you are right now. Now in a moment, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is as soon as you put your right hand on your right eye, as soon as you put your right hand on your right eye, what you'll find is you have x-ray vision. And what that means is you can see through solid objects. As soon as you put your right hand on your right eye. Nod your head if you understand. So like I said in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is as soon as you put your right hand on your right eye, you can see through solid objects. The more you look further away, the more you can see further away. And what that means is you can see through the walls. You can see your neighbor's house. And if you look up, you can see past the ceiling and you can see whatever is outside your house. Nod your head if you understand. So like I said in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is as soon as you put your right hand on your right eye, you'll have x-ray vision. And what that means is you can see through solid objects. And the more you look further away, the more you can see through further away. Because like I said, everything I say becomes your reality. Everything I say becomes the absolute truth. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper, and the deeper you go, the better you feel, and the better you feel, the more you completely go even further. Now, one, two, three, open your eyes, feeling refreshing and amazing. Okay, so before I take you somewhere, like teleport you somewhere, I actually want to, you know, do this in a um, a stepping stone. And I- I'm just trying new suggestions right now. But anyway, I want to do a test before we do that. Can you put your right hand on your right eye and tell me what happens? <laughs> okay, so like I said, you know, I mean, obviously, I'm not, I don't know what's happening, but can you please describe what's happening? Like Just... Okay, try, try not to look, try not to look at people, okay, because that would be really creepy. I don't want you to be like scarred for life, okay? <laughs> but um, can you, can you please describe it? Because this, what's happening right now is your mind is actually constructing this image, thinking that you can, you know, see through things. So... Can you, what can you see? Can you describe it? Can you see it through the ceiling? Yeah, I can see all the stars. <laughs> you can see the stars right now? Okay, in a moment. I'm going to snap my fingers, and as soon as I snap my fingers, you can even see the stars even better in 3, 2, 1. Okay, what about now? Oh, my God. <laughs> so, have you, like, do you stargaze? Do you stargaze? Sometimes, not a lot. Not a lot? Okay. Because I'm going to snap my fingers again, okay? And as soon as I snap my fingers, it's going to look even better in 3, 2, 1. <laughs> Do you know the Milky Way? Are you familiar with the Milky Way galaxy? Yeah. Okay, can you look for it? See if you can find the Milky Way. Oh, 
<laughs> you found it? Okay. Oh, you can't find it, or you did find it. I found it. You found it? Okay, I'm gonna snap my fingers, and this time it's gonna look a million times better in 3, 2, 1. Okay. Well, now at least you can see the Milky Way Galaxy. Yeah. <laughs> so, like I said, this is, you know, this is how amazing your mind can be. And, you know, obviously, uh, take your right hand off, take your right hand off. And as soon as your right hand off, can you see through the, you can see the walls now, can you? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So what's happening is your mind is actually constructing an image of what it's going to look like. If, you know, if you have invisibility powers, like x-ray vision. So that's how, you know, I mean, did it look realistic to you? Yeah, it looked realistic. <laughs> it looked realistic. Okay. So like I said, you know, this is pretty crazy because, you know, some people were like, oh my God, this is completely fake. Like there's no way this is happening. But until you experience it yourself, then, you know, it, it's really hard to, you know, kind of explain how it works. So like again, you know, I didn't want to teleport you to Paris until I see that this works. And obviously you can actually hallucinate and see things. So, okay. So I'm going to teleport you. Are you ready to see Venice, Italy? I don't even, I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right. But just go ahead and just take another nice deep breath in. And just three, two, one, sleep as you go even further and further and further and further still. And the deeper you go, the better and more amazing it completely feels. And the better and more amazing it completely feels, the more your mind goes even further. As it becomes easier for you to even go further. And further now because like I said everything I say becomes your reality everything I say becomes the absolute truth now in a moment in a moment I'm gonna ask you to open your eyes in a moment I'm gonna ask you to open your eyes but what you'll find is you are no longer in your room you are now in a boat in Venice Venice Italy on a river and what you'll find is your laptop is still there it's in the boat with you and you're still talking to me you can still hear me Nod your head if you understand. So like I said, in a moment, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is you are no longer in your room. You are now in a boat in Venice, Italy. And there's a person rowing the boat and you can hear him sing. However, you must stay seated. Because no matter what happens, you cannot get out of the boat because it's, your, it's for your own safety. And like I said... In a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes and you're no longer in your room. You are now in a boat in Venice, Italy on the river and there's a person rowing your boat. However, you are still talking to me through the laptop because your laptop is still there. Nod your head if you understand. And the more you look around, the more realistic it feels and the more realistic it feels, the more it looks even more amazing because you are no longer in your room. You are now in Venice, Italy in a boat. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper. Now, one, two, three, open your eyes and just reveal, refresh and energize. Okay, can you please describe, okay? Just, like I said, just try not to move around, okay? Can you please describe what's happening? Oh my God. Okay, so can you still, like, you see the laptop, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so the laptop's right there. Because I want to make sure, just, I mean, just try to relax, okay? Because I want to make sure that this, you know, that you can keep looking at it, but... This is really hard to explain to people because this is your mind, okay? This is your imagination, not my imagination. This is yours. So can you please describe what you can see? Oh my goodness. I, I, I've, seen, I've seen them in pictures, but not in real life. I mean, I would love to go for sure. Oh my God, this is so cool. <laughs> And the more, the more you look, the more amazing it feels, the more realistic it feels. Like, can you see the water? Are you moving right now on the water? Yes. Sir. Okay, okay. And I mean, unfortunately, you know, it sucks because, you know, instead of, you know, being with someone, you're with a laptop with me. So, <laughs> but next time, but next time, maybe you can go with someone that you love or maybe somebody like a family or something. And I think that'll be a pretty cool experience, you know? Um... So in a moment, I'm going to snap my fingers. And as soon as I snap my fingers, you're going to teleport back in your room in 3, 2, 1. Okay. So <laughs> you want to go back? You want to go back? Okay. Okay, I'm going to snap my fingers again and you'll go back in 3, 2, 1. Welcome back to Italy. And, you know, 
I'm I'm not sure if you're reading or like watching the news right now, but you know, like you know, Italy's like one of the most hard hit, obviously compared to United States. But oh yeah, you know, United States is worse. But you know, they're really you know hard hit right now. So hopefully, mm-hmm. you know, once it becomes better, then you know everybody can come back. But, I mean, I I guess what I'm trying to say is I'm just trying to advertise Italy, you know, for people to check it out as soon as you know everything goes back to normal because it is a beautiful place. Um, uh. Another fact was we we're actually supposed to like we were planning on going to Italy this summer, and obviously with everything that's happening, then you know we can't. But um, you said you've never been to Italy, right? Okay. Why did you like? Why did you want to go? Is it because you just wanted to like be on the boat, just you know, just like you're seeing right now? Well, when I was really little, I watched a movie and like uh-huh. the boat into the water. And I yeah. Like, Wait, which I'm movie is it? I'm going to go there. <laughs> what movie was it? What movie was it? I'm kind of curious. Uh, oh, you don't remember? It was a long time ago. I was, I was okay, a I'm 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 gonna do a test. Okay, I'm gonna snap my fingers, and as soon as I snap my fingers, you'll remember. Okay, in three, two, one. Remember now. Do you remember the movie? Or you still don't? don't okay, so this is something that's really controversial with hypnosis. Is because people. You know, I mean, it really depends, okay? People say that you can remember things through hypnosis. And we just did a test. And this is the second time I tried it when somebody forgot something and they don't remember. So, you know, it's kind of scary. But anyway, uh, I'm just trying to show people, you know, the, the system of hypnosis, okay? Or like things to do with it. And anyway, you know, I mean, I hope you're enjoying your time in, you know, Venice, Italy. Even though, obviously, you're in your room. But right now, your mind is showing you something else. You know, I hope that looks amazing and beautiful and... Um, can you please describe it a little bit more? Like, is there somebody rowing your boat or? Yeah. Okay, okay. And are are there people? <laughs> it's behind the laptop. Okay. So I mean, are there other people there? Like, are there other boats or? Okay, I will go now. I see I'm the only boat. I'm uh-huh. just walking around. Oh, okay, okay. So there's actually so you're kind of like going through I a canal. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so cool. <laughs> I mean, un- I mean, obviously, unfortunately, you know, you have to go back to your room. I mean, it would be kind of crazy if I just leave you there. You know, that would be really bad. <laughs> but you know, like, like I said, hopefully, you can see this in real life. You know, I mean, pretty sure one day, you know, once I mean, I'm not sure if normal is gonna be the same normal that we used to have. But you know, hopefully, one day, you know, we can all visit Italy because you know it is really beautiful. Um, just like as you can see. You know, um, one thing about your mind, though, I just want to show you. Uh, I, I'm trying to explain you how hypnosis works because, like I said, this is the image. This is what your mind think it really looks like, and obviously, your mind think it's beautiful, right? Just like you said. So this is, you know, what your mind perceive Venice, Italy looks like on a boat. So, you know. Anyway, I mean, that's that sounds pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna do a new suggestion. I've never done this suggestion before. Um, but is it okay if I would take you to the moon? Okay, you know, it sounds kind of cheesy, right? But I mean, I'm actually going to literally, you know, make you think you're in the moon. Just just take a nice deep breath in. Okay. And three, two, one. Sleep as you go even deeper and deeper and deeper. And the deeper you go, the better you feel, the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. Now, in a moment, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is you are no longer in Venice, Italy. You are now in the moon. You are now in the moon. And what you'll find is you can see Earth right in front of you. And you can see the stars in the back. And you can just see the sun just a little bit. Not too bright, but you can still see it. So like I said in a moment, I'm going to ask you to, uh, to open your eyes. But what you'll find is you are no longer in Italy. You are now in the moon. And you're wearing this suit. And you can still breathe. And you can still hear me through your through your ears. Because I am still talking to you. However, just like when you're in Italy, you cannot move. You must stay in place. Especially in the moon because it's a very dangerous place. Nod your head if you understand. So like I said in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes. But what you'll find is you're no longer in Italy. You are now in the moon. You are now on the ground on the moon. But you must stay in place. You can see Earth right there. You can see the stars and you can see the sun. And you know, you are wearing this astronaut suit so that you can still talk to me and you can still breathe nod your head if you understand now one two three open your eyes 
Okay, so can you can you please describe what you can see? Because like I said, I've never done this suggestion before. Okay, um, can you can you please describe me where you're at? <laughs> are are you wearing something? Yeah, I'm wearing this shoe. It's an astronaut shoe. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So like you can see like the gloves and stuff. Yeah. Okay, okay. So like I said, just make sure you don't move around, okay? Because I want to make sure, you know, you're in a safe place, okay? So just try to stay still. But I mean, you can move your hands around and you can look around. But can you please describe me what you can see around you? It's just white. It's just white ground. And I can okay. See. It must be really tempting to jump because, you know, obviously the gravity... Yeah, I really <laughs> yeah just don't jump because I don't want you to, you know... Because, uh, I mean, that, I, I got to figure out a way to, like, make the suggestion work so you can jump. But let's, let, you know, maybe that's in the future future videos. But can you see the earth? Can you see earth? Yes. You can? Okay. <laughs> and I'm going to snap my fingers. And as soon as I snap my fingers, it's going to look even more amazing in 3, 2, 1. Oh, my God. <laughs> Well, welcome, welcome to the moon. I know Elon Musk is trying to take people there, you know, because he's trying to make sure space exploration is, you know, still happening. And this is one way to do it. Um, I mean, obviously, you're not in the moon, but I'm just trying to show you what your mind think what the moon would look like. So um, <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to put you back to your room because, you know, I think we've been having too much fun with teleportation. Is that OK? Or do you want to like stay there for like, I don't know, like maybe 30 more seconds? You just want to like look around a little bit more? Yeah. Okay. I'll, I'll give you like thirty more seconds. Okay. Um, and then maybe one day you can actually go to the moon. Who knows? You know. I mean, we're trying to go there, but obviously it's pretty dangerous. But it's you know I think it is important that we keep going forward wherever we're going. <laughs> so I mean, th this is one thing. I mean, obviously in the movies, whenever we watch movies, right? Whenever they show the picture of the. Uh, the the earth when you're in the moon like you can't really see the stars but like over there can you actually like picture stars because i'm not really sure how you know how that works you know maybe i need to ask an actual astronaut or you know but can you see stars right now can you see the sun or you know like like i said this is just your mind right this is how your mind perceives it I can see the sun, but I can see stars. you can see stars okay okay cool cool okay so like i said i'll probably um bring you back to earth <laughs> But um, have you ever watched Harry Potter? Have you ever watched Harry Potter? No. You've never watched Harry Potter? Okay. Do you have a blanket close by? I mean, in your room? Yeah. Or, okay, okay. So, I mean, can you see? This is something that happens, right? Okay, so, like, I just asked you if you have a blanket in your room. Are you back in your room right now, or where are you? Okay. I'm, okay, I'm going to snap my... I'm gonna snap my fingers, okay? And as soon as I snap my fingers, you'll be back in your room in three, two, one. You're back to your room. Okay. I am so sorry. That's like, you know, that's a very unprofessional of me because I wanna make sure you your your mind can perceive the things right, okay? You know, I wanna make sure you can actually see through things. I mean see things. <laughs> Not see through things. But do you have a blanket close by? Yeah. Okay, do you mind grabbing it real quick? And you are in your room, right? You can see your room right there. Yeah. You can move around and stuff. Okay, just be safe, okay? Um, because I want to make sure you're completely, you know, safe. Okay, so just put it in your lap for now. Put it, put your blanket in your lap, okay? Um, I completely forgot this uh, suggestion, but this is something else that, you know, I want people to see, so. Um, ready? Okay, so just take a nice deep breath in. And three, two, one. Sleep as you go even deeper. And deeper, and deeper. Now the deeper you go, the better you feel, and the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. Now in a moment, in a moment, I'm going to ask you to open your eyes, and what you'll find is, like I said, you are completely back to your room. However, your blanket is no longer an ordinary blanket. Your blanket is now an invisibility blanket. And what that means is as you put something inside the blanket, the blanket becomes invisible and whatever inside it becomes invisible and as soon as you put whatever is inside a blanket out the blanket goes back to normal and whatever comes out of it goes back to normal nod your head if you understand so like i said in a moment i'm gonna ask you to open your eyes but what you'll find is you have an invisibility blanket 
And what that means is as soon as you put something inside a blanket, it becomes invisible. So for example, if you put your hand inside a blanket, the blanket becomes invisible and your hand becomes invisible. Only when you put something inside the blanket. And as soon as you put your hand out of the blanket, you can see your hand again and you can see the blanket again. Nod your head if you understand. Perfect. The deeper you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you completely go. Now, one, two, three. Open your eyes. Feeling amazing and energized. Okay, so I want you to do a test. And can you see the blanket right now? Okay, can you put your hand inside the blanket and tell me what happens? <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? Okay, I can't take. See from here. Okay, take your take your, take your hand out. Take your hand out. No way. <laughs> I know, right? No way. I mean, have, you've never had an invisibility blanket before. It's never happened. Oh my god. <laughs> you know, see how powerful your mind can be. You know, like um, it's really it's really hard to explain this because obviously I'm seeing your blanket, but you can't see it if you put something inside. So there's this scene in Harry Potter. I mean, I recommend you watching Harry Potter because I think it is pretty cool. Um, but can you put the blanket around your shoulders? Just just put, put the blanket around your shoulders and just try to cover your whole body, but you can still see your head, obviously. Okay. But like, try to cover your whole body with it. <laughs> That's a really tiny blanket. Is that it's really like, a blanket? <laughs> it's like, um... Oh, do you put it on? Oh, no, no, you don't. wear it like this. Oh, okay. It's like one of the mermaid ones. Yeah, yeah, it looks pretty nice. Is it from Amazon or? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> what's going on? What's going on? Tell me what's going on. I literally can see like through. I mean, like I don't even like. <laughs> okay. I mean, it doesn't. <laughs> I hope it doesn't sound too scary, right? Because one time when I did this. You know, and then when they opened their eyes, you know, they got scared because they couldn't see their legs. You know, I want to make sure you're okay. You're not freaking out. Are you? No, it's cool. <laughs> Are you okay? Okay. So, like, even when you look in the camera, it's still invisible. So, like, right now, when you look, like, can you see your head? But you can't see your your body? Yeah. So, like, you can, <laughs> so you can see the, uh, you can see the chair behind you. Is that what's happening? Is that what hap What's happening? Like, is like, is your head floating, and then you can see what the chair behind you, or what's it's going head on? Head in the wall. <laughs> just, just the head in the wall. Okay, okay. And so, like I said, this is this is this is how the invisibility cloak works. You know, I mean, like at least the way your mind sees it. So, I'm probably gonna do a couple more suggestions, and obviously, we've been talking for quite some time. But you said other than um. You know, sleeping earlier or maybe like helping you sleep. Is there any other thing that you want me to help you? Is a hypnosis is a tool to help you, or that's your number one thing right now is just sleeping earlier. Sleeping yeah. earlier. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's really my number one thing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sleeping is like my really like only thing I have. I can barely hear you. I am so sorry. Do you mind like like speaking out louder or just like typing it? Okay, sleeping is your number one thing. And that's pretty funny because, you know, like like a lot of people are having a lot of time, you know, like a lot of people are staying more awake. And I think one of the reasons is, you know, everybody's stressed out right now, you know, with everything that's happening. I mean, I'm not sure. Are you, are you, are you like uh, in, like, are you taking classes right now? Like, are you doing like online classes or like does school completely stop for you? I'm doing online classes. You're still doing online classes, yeah. So, same here, you know. It's, it's really very different, you know. No one has been in this, you know, kind of stress before. So, I mean, I understand it, you know. I mean, just because you're not sleeping, you know, I just don't want you to feel bad, I guess. Because, mm -hmm. you know, a lot of people are like, oh, my God, you know, I didn't get any sleep. But, you know, we're all in this together. So, you know, it sounds really cheesy, but, you know, like I said, no one has experienced this before, at least not in our lifetime. Um, but anyway, um, like I said, we're going to do a couple more suggestions and then obviously I'm going to let you go because we've been talking and I need to sleep also. Um, but, okay, three things, okay. Would you, or like, who's your favorite singer? Who's your favorite Shawn singer? Mendes. Shawn Mendes. Yeah. I'm really, I'm really sorry for 
<laughs> okay, well, I'll make sure you don't speak really loud, okay? You just just try yeah, to be quiet. Wait, wait, I'm so sorry. Did you say you need to, like, sleep pretty soon? Oh, okay, okay. Well, I mean, if you need to sleep, you need to sleep, okay? I mean, you, you do need to sleep. So, <laughs> so do you need to go right now, or... I have to go. I'm so sorry. Okay, okay. I'm gonna completely wake you up, okay? Because I want to make sure you, you, you know. Because if I say, if I, <laughs> if I say sleep, I don't want you to like, you know, like fall down and never. Cause I'm gonna completely wake you up, and like really fast. I'm just gonna help you sleep, okay? Okay. Okay. Just take a nice deep breath in, and just try to focus, okay? Just take another nice deep breath in, and three, two, one, sleep as you go even further, and further. And further now. Now, in a moment, in a moment, I'm gonna count from one to five. When I reach the number five, all the suggestions gonna be completely gone, and you'll remember. You'll remember everything that happened, from forgetting your name, from going to Venice, Italy, from seeing the moon. You'll remember everything that happens. Nod your head if you understand. As you go even deeper. However, this last suggestion is gonna be completely stick. This last suggestion is gonna stick, and this is regarding sleeping easier just like you chose to focus in hypnosis what you'll find is as soon as you choose to sleep as soon as you choose to sleep what you'll find it's just very easy to not have any distraction it's just very easy to easily go to sleep as soon as you want to sleep nod your head if you understand so like i said in a moment i'm gonna completely wake you up you're gonna feel refreshed energized completely aware of everything that's happening around you however this last suggestion is gonna stick the suggestion regarding sleeping what you'll find is as soon as you choose to sleep as soon as you want to sleep and choose to sleep what you'll find is every time you do it just becomes so easy to to sleep what you'll find is you know you won't have any distraction and you can just easily focus on sleeping just like when you enter hypnosis it's very similar, just try to focus, but instead of focusing on my voice, you focus on sleeping, focus on your mind relaxing, and just focus on not having any distraction. Nod your head if you understand. So like I said, I'm going to completely wake you up, I'm going to come from 1 all the way to 5, and when I reach the number 5, you're going to be completely aware of everything that's happening, all the suggestions going to be completely gone except the one about sleep, and you'll remember, you'll remember everything that happens. Nod your head if you understand. Now, take a nice deep breath in, and one, just feel yourself becoming more energized, more fresh. You can just feel how you're becoming even more energized every count that goes up. And two, take another nice deep breath in, and just do a quick stretch, and just feel this energy flowing throughout your body. And three, take another deep breath in, and just become more aware of your surroundings as you completely remember everything that happens. All the suggestions are going to be completely gone except the one about sleep. And four, and can take another nice deep breath in. You're almost there. You just feel like you just had six hours of nap. And five, completely wide awake. So, thank you so much for trying hypnosis. I hope that wasn't too crazy. And I know, you know, you said that, you know, you were asking me how long it was going to take. And it took us about an hour. <laughs> so, but I mean, I hope, you do you remember everything that happened? Yes, I do. <laughs> okay. So, I mean, I hope you had a good time. You know, that you saw Italy. You saw Italy, right? Yes, I was on the moon. <laughs> yes. So, like I said, that was a new suggestion. I hope you, you know, I hope you had, you enjoyed that. Um, you know, so a couple things before I completely uh go is I want to make sure you don't go back to sleep. I mean, like you know, if I say sleep, you don't go back, okay? Because I want to make sure that you know you're completely aware of everything. Second, is you know, this is the power of your mind. You know, like I said, you didn't definitely you didn't teleport to the moon, okay? This is just your mind. But mm -hmm. what I'm trying to say is hypnosis is very powerful, okay? So if you're going to do hypnosis, just make sure you're aware of everything that happens, okay? Just, you know, like I said, this is how powerful your mind can be. You know, all I did is, you know, guide you through it. But you have to be aware out there. And third is, you know, I gave you the suggestion about making it easier for you to sleep. But, you know, don't get mad at me if it doesn't work. Because, like I said, this is your mind, okay? So... I'm going to test, make sure you don't fall back to sleep when I say sleep. Are you ready? Okay, just take a nice deep breath in and sleep.
perfect. Okay, thank you so much for trying hypnosis. I hope you know you said. <laughs> like I said, it takes a lot. It, I mean, it takes a lot of work, and you know, I mean, especially for somebody that doesn't really believe in hypnosis. Thank you so much for <laughs> thank you so much for trying it, and, and now you know how it feels. And like I said, it's you know, if people ask me, is this real? The only person that can tell that is you. You know, the person that's actually being hypnotized. Because I mean, I don't know. You could be faking the whole thing, but. At the same time, this is your mind, okay? You know? So, again, thank you so much, and I hope you have a good night, and hopefully you can, you know, sleep easier in the future, because, you know, obviously, no one knows how long this coronavirus is going to last, but um, just stay safe out there, and I hope you have a good night, so. Thank you.